Oi, hello there, YouTube. It's Blackmagic8520. I'm gonna pick up right where we left off in the last video, and we're gonna make a skill calculator now using almost the exact same principles as uh, this calculator here, but you know, for skills. So, um, I'm gonna create a new file. Oh yeah, also, uh, my last videos, they, they've been, like, increasingly long. The first one was 7, the next one was 9, the other one was 12, so I'm going to try to be quicker. Alright, anyway, I started off with this shebang line, user, bin, python, and um, I'm going to show you how to do, like, one thing, but you can write it all out to make a whole, huge, complete skill calculator. But I'm just going to have it as if there was one skill and one uh, ore. We're going to do mining. Um, Alright. Choice equals raw input. What do you want to train? This is going to ask us what do we want to train. And what we put into that, it's going to save as choice. Um, if choice equals equals mining define mining so what we got going on here is if our choice variable is is defined as mining we're gonna tell it to make a mining calculator so make sure you indent so you're in inside the function or whatever and um, if it uh, uh, the if we choose mining we gotta have it ask us what or so or equals the raw in input of which or so we're defining or as which or the raw input of that if our variable choice equals mining uh, oh something tells me this is gonna be wrong um, gotta do another if now If or equals equals iron. So if our or that's defined here is equal to iron, then we're going to create a calculator for iron. Uh, so we got to have it ask us the XP. So it can, you know, do the math. because that's what it's doing and then we gotta get our desired XP dis desired XP same thing as last time make sure you watch that video because it owned so we're getting our current XP and our desired XP um, then hmm then we gotta get our difference variable, which, as I told you last time, is the integer of desired XP minus the integer of the current XP. If I'm going a little fast here, well, I'll slow down for a second. Uh, we're gonna define cho uh, no, we're we're gonna define choice as the raw input of what do you want to train. If we define that choice variable as mining, it's going to ask us which or. And whatever we input to that is going to define our OR variable. And again, another if here, since we the way ifs work is like uh, you can only have one if per variable. Like say, if choice equals mining, if I wanted to make it if choice equals woodcutting, I have to put like elif for that. So the reason I'm using another if is because I moved on to a different variable. But anyway, if this OR, if this OR is equal to iron then it's gonna run the iron calculator that we're gonna make it do and uh, we got our current XP gotta get that and our desired XP it's just gonna ask us you know how much XP do you have and the difference uh, subtraction yada 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 alright uh, then we gotta do or count equals the integer of the difference divided by 35 because uh, iron ore gives 35 mining exp 
and that should give us the amount of ore we need to mine. And now we just need it to print it, it back to us. So print, you need to mine string ore count more iron ores. So right there, this line is saying once it's done all the math, it's going to print back to us. You need to kill or count more ores. And that's our sum right there. Our difference. Or no, our quotient, actually. And, yeah. Pretty quick. I know. Uh, see, now I feel like I've left a lot out because I haven't explained it for ten minutes. But I, th I think you guys can get this. Just, just watch the other two videos and you'll, like, understand everything. Okay, so now i got to save this. And give it permission to run. Oops. And now we can run it. Oh man! See, this is what happens when I go too fast. What's wrong with it? I don't see anything wrong to you. Invalid syntax. All right, I'll figure out what's wrong, and I'll BRB. I have figured out what was wrong. I did not put the extra plus at the end of the string. So, yeah, after you get the script written correctly, you run it. What the hell? Okay, BRB, you got to fix this. All right, I see. I, I just didn't save it after I fixed it. All right, so here's how it's going to look when you run it. What do you want to train? Mining. Which ore? Iron. How much XP do you have? Zero. How much XP do you... That should be want. 350. You need to mine 10 more iron ores. Is that intense or what? Alright. Just gonna change that. I'm gonna run it one more time. Again, if you want to do this with more skills, if you want to do it with more skills, um... Like, if you want to do it with mining and smithing and fishing and wood cutting or whatever uh, you would do something like I'll show you you'd have um, like elif choice equals equals wood cutting then do this if you wanted to have it with more than one type of ore, all you have to do is, um, this, all this is pretty much the exact same thing, except the rest would be elifs. So you'd, you'd be like, elif, elif or equals equals coal. Uh, current XP yada 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 yada. So uh, all you have to do is change the print. So uh, says the correct type of ore. For the second one, do elif. You know, obviously change that and um, change this the EXP value. Although I do not recommend copying and pasting because it may be quicker. Like 95% of the time, you screw something up. And you spend six hours wondering why you have two variables named the exact same thing. And it's retarded. So, yes, that was today's lesson. That wasn't really a lesson. It was just more of a cool project to work on. Uh, me and my friend are working on an entire, like, full calculator for every skill in RuneScape. This is awesome. So, yeah, that's it. Comment, rate, subscribe, and do the little thumbs up thing. Share me on FB. Facebook. Uh, favorite it uh, post it on Twitter I don't care what you do just do it